Hello, welcome to this tutorial. I am Krishna Raghavendran and in this tutorial we are going to learn how to make a simple calculator in MIT App Inventor. So let's start. This calculator will not be like the calculators which, we, which are there in the mobile. It's just a simple one in which there will be two text boxes and the user should enter some number in the in both the text boxes and there will be four operations and if they click the operation it will show the result yes so now let's bring two text boxes then for the operations we are going to use an horizontal arrangement so let's make this center I'm sorry not this one horizontal should be center and let's make this with fill parent now let's put the buttons inside. We need four buttons for the four main operations. So this is going to be subtract this one multiply. And this one divide. You can also put symbols of these operations. So let me make it align horizontal to center. Yes. So now we are going to change the color of this arrangement to something like blue. And you can also make the transparency by moving this down and up. If you go to custom, so I'm going to go to custom. If you want a little bit transparent blue, you can just drag this. So it's going to be like this. So here you cannot see the transparency, but in the mobile, we'll be able to see it. Yes, so now here they need to enter a number. So let's put number. Here number two as the hint. Yes. Now let's rename this button so that we'll be able to understand proper add. Subtract. Multiply. And divide. Yes. So now we need to do the blocks. It's very simple. When add click, we are going to keep a variable called result. We also need for the correct answer for for the operation. So this size is going to be 30 and the font is going to be bold and let's just put 0 here. So now first I'm going to set the result to 0 when I initialize it. So when the add button is clicked, I'm going to set the variable, the result, to textbox1.text plus text box 2 dot text so they will only be able to enter numbers in these text boxes as we are going to use operations so we cannot do like we cannot put letters or symbols here so we are going to put this one numbers only and for even this text box numbers only yes so now after we set the result when they click add, we are going to set the result to the number 1, which is textbox1.txt, plus number 2, which is textbox2.txt. So we just need to copy and paste and do like that for all these. Subtract, I'm going to put, we need to put minus. Yes, so now multiply. Let's put 
multiplication block. Here we have it. And at last, divide. So make sure you are changing this, the button name or else it will not work properly. Yes, so now it works. If you want to round a number, for example, if a number comes like this, 2.8907, if you want to round it to, let's say, 3, or we can also do like 2.9, you can do it easily by using the round block in the map. Here you can see round so if you put this the number will be rounded to a whole number so this will become if we put this for example this in the round the result is going to be three it will remove all the decimal digits and round it off so that it will become three if you want you can make make it for everything but i'm i'm not going to make it yes so now let's test our app and see if it is working. Before that, we forgot the main thing. We need to show it to the user. We are just setting it in a variable. How can we show it? So we are going to show it in label one. So we will put set label one dot text to get result. So let's just put this block in subtract, multiply, and divide. Yes, now our app is ready and we can test our app. So here we can see our simple calculator app. So now let's just, let me just put a number. It's going to be 20 and the second number is going to be 50 and click on add. It shows 70 because I clicked on add and 20 plus 50 is 70. So now I'm going to put 50 and 30. Subtract. You can see that it has subtracted correctly. And then 50 and 30 multiply. It shows correctly. And then let me put 2 and 3 to multiply. It shows correctly. And now for dividing, I'm going to put 10 and 2. Click on divide. It shows 5. So our simple calculator app is working. So thank you for watching this tutorial. Please subscribe, like and share this video. Goodbye.